Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to a brand new unboxing video. And in today's video, we're gonna be unboxing a pair of in-ears from Sennheiser. Before we go any further, I wanna leave a huge shout out to Sweetwater Sound for making this video possible. If you guys are ever in need of musical equipment or audio equipment of any kind, definitely check out Sweetwater Sound. This is the company in which provides me pretty much all of the equipment that I use to make my videos possible here on my channel. And I go to them because they always have the best customer service and the absolute cheapest price. You can also find in the description my personal artist page where you can see every piece of gear that I've ever purchased off Sweetwater and by clicking through that link and then grabbing something off the site you are supporting my channel so thank you so much to Sweetwater and Sennheiser for making this video possible cool so with all that said inside I got the Sennheiser IE 100 pros let's get into it Confidence for any stage, any ear, any time. Okay, cool. So yeah, here we have the Sennheiser IE100 Pro in-ear monitors. If you guys are in the market at all for in-ear monitors, this option is only $100. I gotta tell you guys the truth, that's very affordable in the realm of in-ear monitor systems because you can get up to very high price tags very quickly. On the back here, it just says reinventing the single dynamic driver principle. Detachable stage-proof cable with break-proof connection and reinforced ear hook, comfortable fit, due to compact profile and lightweight yet rugged ear mold design. Extra value with soft pouch and range of ear tips individually adaptable to your ear canal depth. Cool. So let's get inside and check all that out. A little quick guide manual. And then inside here we have, oh, that's pretty cool. And there's like metal pieces that want to form back to the... It's not a magnet, but it closes on its own just like that, which is kind of cool. So pop it open by pressing it, and then we got some adjustable tips. Nothing else inside. That's a really cool little carry case for later. And then the headphones themselves. So one thing that's pretty uniform across the board when it comes to in-ear setups is typically you're gonna have one blue and one red. The red is easy to remember as right because R for red, R for right. So the red side I'm gonna put in first in my right ear. And uh, I'm just gonna take it, it's already in like a loop position, so I'll just pull my hair out of the way, loop it around the back, and then push it in like that. And then there you go. Now we'll rinse and repeat for the other side. Cool, and just like that, they're in. I'm gonna plug it into an older uh, iPhone 6 because of course we actually have a headphone port. Ba-boom. All right, so let's do this. Let's listen to some music. Just gonna pull up Spotify and jam something. I'll let you guys know what I think. I was just listening to this song specifically. You guys can't hear it, but I was just listening to this song in the car, so. Wow. All right, so that's pretty cool. Yeah, the sound quality is actually really phenomenal. I'm super impressed. Over the years, I've gone through like three or four sets of these like $100 price range in-ear setups, like the one that you guys just currently watched me unbox. It wasn't this one specifically. I think this is a newer one out by Sennheiser. And I've never tried the Sennheiser versions. I tried other brands in the past. This so far, for the price point, is definitely the best audio quality I've heard out of these $100 in-ear setups that you can get like this. That was really, really awesome listening to that track with these headphones in. I'm actually gonna be giving these to Lindsay and they're gonna be what she listens to music with as we do our reactions for the channel. So this is gonna be an upgrade for her. She has another pair of in-ear monitors at the moment that we use for those videos and the left ear has been dead for a while so she's been only able to hear it in one ear and even then if you wiggle the cable in a certain way, she loses it in the one ear that she can hear it in. So this is, um, this is for her. So I'm really stoked that she'll be able to hear with really good audio quality for a single driver setup. My God, thank you so much Sennheiser and Sweetwater for sending this out. I hope I wasn't yelling. I might've been yelling there because I had them in my ears. I feel like I definitely was yelling. The tips, the ones that came stock out of the box were a little bit small for my ear canal, but they do, like it said on the back, they have multiple tip sizes that will work for blocking out more sound if you need it. The thing about the canal sizes too is like, I always go by what the, what the use is gonna be. Like I like a little bit of a smaller one if I'm not gonna be drumming with it because then I can have it in a little bit longer and it's a little bit more comfortable just to have on the go and like out and about or doing some things or, or even streaming because we use uh, inner monitor 
monitors for our Twitch streams, which is a really great use for a pair of in-ear monitors like this, especially in this class where it's only a hundred bucks and you don't need molds or anything like that. You can just chuck it in. What I'm saying there is if I'm doing something at the drum set or if I'm at a show and I really want like, or I'm performing and I really want a lot of blockage, I personally will go with a larger size on the tip. And then if I'm doing something a little bit chiller with the specific pair of in-ears in mind, I'll use a smaller tip so I can have them in longer without experiencing any discomfort. Now, when I say longer too, I'm really talking about like hours at a time. Cause for the Twitch streams, I'll sit there with a pair of in-ear monitors in for like four hours. And they're not typically intended to be in your ear canal for that long. So comfort is really important in those situations. Inside the packet of uh, ear tips, there's also the little cleaning device, uh, which comes pretty much standard in all of the in-ears you're gonna have. So really important to keep these guys clean, take the tips off and go into the driver and get out any gunk that accumulates in there over time. It is a form of wear and tear on the actual driver. So you don't want any of that in there. It's really important to make sure to keep your ears clean as well as keep the things that are going into your ears as clean as possible. In closing out, I just wanna talk about the tech specs real quick. So these feature a single 10 millimeter driver. The uh, cable here too is also detachable. Like right here, you can pull this off. That's really important, honestly, because in these setups, the expensive part is always the driver. Knowing from personal experience, I was in a situation once where I was on the road with a pair of in-ears very similar to this and the cable broke, but the drivers were still fine. At the time too, I wasn't in a position where I could just buy a hundred dollar pair of in-ears. So I could buy a 10, I think it was a $15 cable replacement though, which is cool. So you can actually take the driver off, get a new cable if the cable has an issue, put the driver on the new cable and save yourself a ton of money and just keep using the same drivers for as long as they don't break themselves. Last two things I wanna mention before I'm gonna close out this video. First of all, these come in three different colors. So I got the clear ones here, but you can get the black and the red as well, depending on the vibe you're going for. And what it changes is the cable will stay the same color, but the actual drivers will be different. You can check that out down in the description at the product link where you can pick up a pair of these for yourself if you're looking to do that. What really comes to mind for me is streaming. Definitely really cool for if you go in for a certain look and you don't wanna have over ears on, you wanna rock the behind the back, cable up the shirt, in-ear monitors, so it all looks very clean and, and put together for a stream. So I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing and first look at the Sennheiser IE100 Pro in-ear monitors. Thanks so much for checking out this video. If you liked it, make sure to give it a like and I'll see you guys all very soon with something new.